What's going on, Cardinal Nation? Well, man, rough game tonight. Losing this one 10-3 to to the Cincinnati Reds in the third game of four. And, yeah, 10-3, to Steven Matz still winless this season. And uh, Matz just really ever since joining the Cardinals last season really has not done that that well. He's battled injuries and just been very inconsistent. Uh, and wouldn't be surprised really if the Cardinals decided to trade him at the trade deadline. So, um, so the Reds will take a early 2 nothing lead, bottom of the first. Uh, RBI, two run single by uh, Tyler Stevenson before that. A uh, Error by the right fielder, Oscar Mercado. Uh, and then the next batter, Stevenson, would drive in two to make it a 2 nothing game. And then they would go up 4 nothing RBI double by Kevin Newman, scoring two more runs to make it a 4 nothing game. So it was a long first inning for Matt's over 40 pitches. Uh, and finally, we give up four runs. On four hits. So, it would then stay 4 nothing until the bottom of the third. Kevin Newman, RBI single to make it a 5 nothing game. And then we would get on the board to make it 5 to 1. Top of the fourth, solo home run by Brendan Donovan. Fourth home run for Donovan. And so that would give us a, or that would make it a 5 to 1 game. Uh, and Matt's in the bottom of the fourth, give up a solo home run to rookie Matt McClain, his second career home run. He hit his first career home run last night. So that would make a 6 1 game, and you were able to cut the lead to 6 2. Lars Newbar solo home run to his fourth, which made it 6 2, and Matt's would be done after four innings, giving up 11 hits, six runs. Two walks, struck out two on 90 pitches, and then Chris Stratton would come in at the bottom of the fifth. And uh, a scoreless fifth inning for Stratton. And then you pitch in the bottom of the sixth. Uh, Nick Senzel on sack fly, and then Stuart Fairchild, RBI double to make it an 8 2 game. Yancis Cabrera would then come in to replace Stratton. Uh, and then uh, Cabrera on the pitch in the bottom of the seventh, give up a two-run single to Spencer Steer to make it a 10-2 game. But we'll then get two flyouts, and then uh, Nolan Gorman with the leadoff walk in the top of the eighth, uh, and he then make it a second on a wild pitch. Uh, but then three straight flyouts. And so then, then Cabrera pitching in the bottom of the eighth at a one, two, three, eighth inning. As Alec Burleson took over at first, trades Barrera behind the plate. And then Lars Newbar would make it a ten to three game with an infield hit. And uh we had runners on second and third, but Nolan Gorman would strike out even if he hit a homer that would make it a four-run game, but regardless, that was it. And yeah, so a rough night. Reds with 18 hits in this game, four of them by first baseman Spencer Steer. So all but one guy in their lineup had at least a hit. And yeah, and uh, the top five guys in the lineup all scored two runs, so a huge night offensively. And their starter, Ben Lively, went six innings. So, fortunately, we know we will not be able to win this series, but we could possibly not lose the series either if we can split this, the four games Thursday afternoon. Miles Michaelis gets a start against Luke Weaver for the Reds. Luke Weaver, former Cardinal, Traded 
uh, as part of the Paul Goldschmidt trade back in the 2019 offseason and has bounced around with a number of teams since. So, until Thursday, comments, Twitter saying, go cards.